Somebody just asked me about canopy management. Uh, here is your takeaway for today. You'll often hear us say morning side, afternoon side. We know this is the canopy, right? This is the leaf canopy. These are our solar panels. The morning side is when the sun is rising, um, and the sun rises, for those who don't know it, in the east, um, it's typically less warm because the sun is um, just rising and the rays aren't as powerful. It really depends on your slope and your aspect ratio and stuff like that, but just know that your grapes usually aren't getting baked in the morning. This is kind of a good example of a morning side of the canopy. There's some leaves here. It's pretty open on this side because we're trying to, trying to help the cab sov here get ripened, right? Morning side, more open canopy. Now, in 30 plus minutes or so, the sun is now going to be continuing, or the earth will be continuing. The, earth is going to be, the sun's gonna be staying in one spot. Earth is gonna be continuing its rotation. And then the afternoon side of the canopy is really when temps really start warming up here in Napa Valley, um, we don't want it to be completely open because then these would just get baked and turn into raisins. So you can see the foliage is much thicker here so we can allow dappled sunlight to get through in a way to protect it. And we still have our solar panels, our leaves, which are helping the vine health. What else do we look for here? We're checking out the, the, the health of the canopy. Now we're still, we're at Broken Rock. We're still pretty early in the growing season being kind of moving into uh, the last part of August. But um, we've had so little rain this year that this is one of those years where we, we, you know, how we always say we want to stress the vines, we want to stress the vines. You want to stress the vines, but you don't want to be so stressed that the, leaf, the canopy just starts turning yellow and then you have really inefficient photosynthesis. You don't want the vines going into senescence too early. Late August, we're still six weeks away here. We were just checking out the Merlot block and here we still have some berries going through verasion, but it's real, you can see this little guy who's green. T today is a Tuesday, by Thursday, basically all evidence of green berries will be gone. Everything colors up pretty darn rapidly. And um, so then we'll be 100% through verasion, and then it's typically four to six weeks. But that four to six weeks, what's the major thing? Mother nature. We'll be paying attention to how uh, the weather, the temperatures, the amount of sun, all these things come into play. And, and Patrick's really, really good at that. And of course we keep on coming back. But the cab at Broken Rock, the Merlot at Broken Rock, looks rock solid. Everything's tucked into the wires. Um, and, uh, and now it's just the march toward harvest. Um, everything looks good. But your takeaway from today, open in the morning, closed in the afternoon. We're a breakfast restaurant. Greetings from Broken Rock.